Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Fishing in Tennessee. Today I have another review, and it is on the Quantum Tour KVD Rod and Reel. I got these last year for Christmas. You probably seen it in my last Rod and Reel Arsenal video, and I hadn't used it yet until this year. And the first fish I caught off of it, I was going to use as a top arm rod. Uh, first fish I caught off it was a big 6-2. Uh, pretty spine bass, big female. And uh, let's go over the specs. It is the rod. It's a 610 medium, which is just about right for top water. It's got the right tip on it, the right length, so you can cast those poppers and say like those uh, sexy dogs and things like that around. Like I like to throw a bone sexy dog or a hadone, is there a spook or heading, heading, sorry, my bad. Um, and then the reel is a quantum tour KVD, like I said, so, so is the rod, the exact same, like series. And uh, it's a tour KVD, and it is a 7 3 to 1, has 11, bo has 11 bearings in it, and left hand retrieve, 7 3 to 1. Real good reel. Reason I like the left hand retrieve, I can't pop real good with my right hand. I can pop real good with my right hand, I just can't reel and pop with my left hand. It's the thing. I like fishing worms with my right hand, but I can't pop all day with this thing. Unless I use my left where I got used to it with a spinning reel. But the rod's been real good. Got me some decent fish this year, like I said. Uh, just like I did in the last video. It was a tough year this year on my lake. They left the water down lower than they should have, and then they pulled it up, and the fish were used to the deep water, and top water prevailed a little bit in the morning, maybe just a tad bit. So did the crankbaits, and that was about it. And you just couldn't get many bites in the evening off those two techniques right there. You really had to either throw a big worm in about 10 feet of water and try to catch those fishes down there, or you'd have to get you a big DT-10 or something like that and scrape the bottom and try to pull you out a big hoss. But, well, thank you guys for watching. Uh, we'll have one more, one or two more videos after this, and we'll see you then.